Good morning, I'm Manny Anton for the Finance News Network. The S&P 500 fell Thursday, breaking an eight-day winning streak as rising yields shook investor confidence. The benchmark index was trading down 0.8%, while the Nasdaq was 0.9% weaker. The Dow Jones Industrial Average was 0.7% lower. All S&P sectors were trading in negative territory, with the worst performing sectors including healthcare down 2.1%, consumer discretionary down 1.8%, and real estate down 1.5%. The best performing sectors included industrials, which were down 0.25%, and energy down 0.27%. Stocks hit session lows after Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell indicated more work may need to be done to bring down inflation, although the recent slowdown in pace has been an encouraging sign for policymakers. The move lower in stocks also coincided with an uptick in yields. A US Treasury auction earlier in the session also contributed to that. The benchmark 10-year Treasury yield was up more than 12 basis points at 4.632%. The 30-year bond rate jumped 11 basis points to 4.772%. In company news, Disney rose 6.9% after reporting better than expected profit and expanding its cost-cutting plan while ARM dipped 5.2% following its first quarterly report as a public company. MGM Resorts dipped about 1.1% even after posting strong results and a new share buyback program. Shares in Tesla tumbled after HSBC initiated coverage of the EV maker with a reduced rating. Nvidia rallied after a Chinese report that the company plans to release three new artificial intelligence chips for China. Oil edged higher as Saudi Arabia's energy minister on Thursday said oil consumption remains healthy and blamed speculators for the recent drop in prices. Markets are increasingly of the view that Saudi Arabia will extend its unilateral 1 million barrel per day cut well into the first quarter of 2024. Iron ore traded in Singapore closed above US 125 a tonne. The outlook for the steel making material has improved as China continues to indicate it is moving to stabilise the real estate sector. The SPY futures are pointing to a 0.1% fall. Thanks for watching and have a great weekend.